Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do a little bit of gardening, aren't we, Nora? We're going to garden, so we're going to plant some flowers. Can you put the flowers? Yeah. So we got to plant this that mommy put there. We got this on sale at Myers for two dollars. Got two of these. We've got this pretty little annual right here, which is a. I don't know. A sun, a sun patent. Sun patience. Sun patient. Yeah. Blooms nonstop, spring through frost. We'll see. A sunflower. I wetted them yesterday, but they already dried out because it's hot. Grab the superfood. Guys, so for the purpose of this video, I wanted to show you what I use to give flowers year round. I've got petunias, lilies, tons of roses. We got lots of roses. Yeah. You're too cute. So, what I use to keep blooms year round is Scott's Super Bloom. There are a couple of different brands that make a fertilizer. This contains 12% nitrogen, 55% phosphorus. The phosphorus is the ticket. And 6% potassium. And this is a three gallon bucket. So we're gonna do, um, we're gonna do one scoop. Now let's do one and a half. So it comes with this little tablet. So one scoop. And we'll do the small scoop as well. All right. Nora, I forgot our mixer. So you can use a mixer, but you can just fill water with a spray jet and that'll mix with it pretty good. And what this does is it's going to help with the rooting on these new plants. It's also going to help me have beautiful flowers of all different varieties and kinds. So some of this I've already done. But the new stuff we have to do, and I have to water the left side over here. So we have here all these beautiful succulent type plants that give off different colors, white, yellow, red, pink. And then I've got these starburst guys over here. I don't know the name of these. We just got that. We've got some roses that are struggling back there and some other things. We're going to go ahead and water these though so we can keep the flowers blooming. Oh, you found a leaf? That's all right. All right, so we're gonna make another batch. What a lot of people do is they can either do a spray tank for this, or you can just get a five gallon bucket or a couple five gallon buckets and good to go. I use this every two weeks. Some people alternate with the different lower phosphorus and they do a high nitrogen and a high potassium. Yeah, we need more water, don't we? Is it loud, Nora? Hey, do you want to go get your water cup? So we can, we can, where's your water? Let that fill up. Here, you want to go water some stuff? Okay, so water. There you go. Thanks. You're welcome. Can you pick something to water? 
Awesome. All right, so I do this every two weeks. All right, so throughout the year, every two weeks I'm using the Super Bloom. So one week I'll water or I'll let the rain water it, and then the next week I would use the Super Bloom, even if it did rain. And this just keeps the blooms coming and coming and coming, even if it's 90 degrees out, and some of these things don't love 90 degrees. All right, let's turn that back on, kid. We gotta fill this up. So I found my Super Bloom at Lowe's for $16, $17. It's a little expensive. I put less than the directions say. Um, just simply I wanted to go farther. I mean, it seems to be a, a good mix for me. All right, let's go, Nora. Let's go do some more. What? All right, guys, so if you really want your flower beds and your blooms to just stand out this year, check out something like this. It's a water-soluble powder. Banana. It's easy to use. You mix it up, pour it in your flower beds. Banana. You're good to go. You're gonna have a beautiful, blooming flower bed that matches your beautiful yard and your beautiful family. We will see you next time, neighbors. If you enjoyed this, like. If you enjoyed it even more and you wanna keep watching, subscribe. 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 <laughs> Love you. Bye. Thank you.